My name is Matt Molinaro. I'm an assistant chief in an EMT with the Old Strohs Fire Company. Um, in recent days, we have been given um, some pet rescue masks from the county executive's office. Um, these rescue masks are used for animals um, anywhere from dogs, cats, ferrets, rabbits, birds, um, pretty much any of your household pets these can be used for. They come in three different sizes, this being the longest one, um, goes over top of the animal's snout and is given full oxygen through the hose. Um, based on the size of the animal is what the liter per mount that you give the oxygen for. Uh, statistically, most animals are left home during the day by themselves and unlike humans, uh, when there is an emergency, they run and hide. So firemen do their best to go in and get those animals at a structure fire. If for some reason they get to the animal and they are deceased, we'll do our best to take them outside and give them some oxygen. However, in recent days for us, we actually had a structure fire where a couple of animals were rescued and the dog just was overcome with smoke inhalation. He was conscious and alert. However, um, we just put one of these pest rescue masks over top of his nose and administer some oxygen. Um, Ulster Hose has had these for about 15 years on our own, on some of our rigs. Um, and at the fire that we most recently had, that was one of our own. So the county executive has given us some more, just another tool for another one of our trucks. And we appreciate that. And uh, hopefully we never have to use them.